democracy on the rise. No no time to wait for the slow changes in the minds of the people. For our own sake, must force the matter swiftly. Uh, oh no. Diverging viewpoints. Okay. I don't know what it does. Support weapons three. Let's get industry equipment three. We need more steel. We gotta reduce our steel. Finland's at war with Soviet Union now. There. Another decision. There. Yeah, it's slow. You just gotta get them down. We got supplies, they don't. I mean, supplies wise, they're only at 65%. Well, that was fast. Okay. I gotta get less than 80% pull board. That's a big change in popularity. We want to force it, of course. Can the allies even win? I mean, oh wow. Oh, they can win. They just won that. And they got some troops to kill. They can push west. See, their problem is their strength's going down. They don't have strength. Whereas we're at full strength. And it just keeps going down. Because they can't produce enough guns. And their organization drops too. Democratic opposition forming. Laxing restrictions on what sort of anti Kumiantang propaganda can be spread publicly led to an increase in public expressions of dissent. Organized demonstrations pamphlets are so far found mostly in academic institutions, some of China's war unfortunate areas. There's little doubt that the movement is spreading. The nation's leaders are torn over this issue. Chiang Kai shek who maintains an iron grip on party leadership, it's little diversity does or desire to diversify public debate. First steps already been taken, however, and there may be no turning back. Exactly. That helps. 25%. Nice. Oh, this is free. Well, China. Done. Second main event. Please be an event. No. The end of the Chinese Civil War. Nothing like that. Yeah, you're defenders. You're also defenders. Wow, we missed out a lot of deserters. We need more of you. Look at our manpower.
We have another 24 units. Land act reform. Let's go. Refugee relief in something. Getting our artillery built. That's good. Yeah, we're going more and more democratic. All right. Well, you're expanding civil support. Bam. Kids in tungsten. Awesome. Getting factories built. I need some more of you guys, though. This can get way out here. Let this fix on its own. There we go. So how do we get these guys? We can kick from faction, but... How do we get them in our... thing? We can pick a fight with Japan again. Go foreign threats. Or interior. This one! This one! Integrate the warlords. Definitely. Well, we know where we're going. Well, after that. We need to get this up. It's slow. But we're getting there. Maybe once we get to 40%, we can do some other stuff. But yeah, democracy's spreading quickly. Jeez. All those units. Let's just do an infantry swarm. Wait, if I do infantry swarm, did I go the wrong direction? In, not there, here. Let's see. Supply clamps is decent. Tanks wouldn't work for infantry wave. That doesn't either. That does. Break through an organization. Okay, that helps. This doesn't. This does. Continuous offensive. In this case, now shard, attrition. Oh, that's so good against Soviets. Maybe that's a good idea. Inventory recovery rate, that's good. Organization, that's nice. Reinforce rate, combat with, population, that's great. That's not. Is there one that's organizational also while moving? Because that's kind of a good thing. Okay, there's not. See, I, I like where we went. If we subjugate the warlords, who is it all? It's five people. So one, two, three, four. Yep, that's all five. 
Okay. Let's go motorized. Iron ore deposits. Don't want to be able to get some oil when we get excavation 4. Trotsky survives. Sort of not 40 yet. When you get to 40, things might be different. Refugee relief. Nationalism. I wonder if 40% gets us anything. Because 30% is a sizable minority. Yep, 40%. Nothing happened. So I don't need to do that. It barely does anything. Actually, no. We need to get our doctrine done. There we go. And we're working on more factories, which is good. 5% of our population is 20 million. Well, actually, it's probably more than 21 million. Japan demands. Oh, shit. There. Gary joined. Okay, 1940. I'm gonna use. I think we need to get a navy, honestly. Battleships are always the best. So we'll get battleships. There. Okay, three. It's gonna be three, three, three. Two. Okay. Oops. I see the problem. One of you. Not you. Go back to normal mode. One of you. Let's go over here. Or at twenty nine, ah, oh. there. Okay, let's start a new army.
Yeah, you'd be temporary. Okay, then I got a here. There. There. So you. Get over here. If war happens, which I know it will, we'll be ready. In fact, get more ready. There. We'll be ready. Yeah, I mean, the Allies are hard pressed to win here. They're not doing well in North Africa. Then when the Allies or the U.S. joins, if they join, because they like to be late to the party. Yeah, there's really not much we can do right now. Fine, we'll expand civil support. So slow. I should have waited on the discredited government thing. Nationalism's here. Prioritized interior. Italy's gonna go to war with Greece. You're gonna be here. You should be here. Got an offensive line. Somewhere around here. Actually, non offensive line. Because we don't want troops in Siberia. So, really, you want a spearhead right here. That's what you would do. Someone's supposed to constantly draw on screen, though. There we go. Yeah, if war breaks out, we'll take that over. We gotta protect Korea. Which we will eventually get around to. I'm gonna get artillery. And what would adding some support to the army do? It would. Oh, we have 2k. What if. Instead of support. We go for a regular artillery. Couldn't quite squeeze it, but let's go for it. We'll get it eventually. I mean, we're going over 10 a day. We're about to get a new tack. We're only at 42.8%. Slow. Well, guys, as you can see, we're doing quite well as China. Japan still exists. But we've won the war. We'll go to war with them eventually. Right now, I think we've got a more immediate threat. But we'll see. Anything can change. And we may go after Japan instead. The only reason I'm hesitant to do that is we have no need. But maybe Guangxi does. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. 
I will see you in the next episode.